Oh well, hello friends and welcome back to my channel. Today I have a very fun and exciting video for y'all. I was contacted by the Ashley Shelley Planner Company and was asked if I would be interested in taking a peek at their 2021 planners. And I said, well, yeah, duh. And this just showed up on my doorstep and I wanted to open it with you guys. So I haven't opened it yet. Um, I have my Dollar Tree sticky notes that don't stick still, so I'm working on that. I haven't even slid it, so let's slice this baby open and see what's inside. I want to say that I had an Ashley Shelley planner for review a few years back. I can't remember. Anywho. So let's open up the pretties. Oh, beautiful. Oh, nice. All right, this is for you guys. So this is from Ashley and it says, thank you so much, Emily. Coupon code for your followers, Emily2021 for $5 off of a 2021 signature or petite planner and it expires on September 30th, 2020. So. I'm gonna put that information down below along with the website. So, yay, thanks Ashley. Um, yeah, hopefully you guys can see that. Yeah, sorry if that was a little blown out before. Okay, perfect. Well, that's awesome. Didn't know you guys were gonna get a little code, but that's always fabulous. All right, so let's look at the things. Okay, boop. Do, do, do. All right, so there's a couple of things here. There are two different planners, which I knew there was gonna be two different planners, but I wasn't really like too sure on what they were. So in my box was this little card that says, create your best days. And it just has like the contact information for Ashley Shelley. So um, you could just follow her on Instagram at Ashley Shelley. And then the website is ashleyshelley.com. So let's start out with the launch day. So launch day is going to be Friday, September 4th at 10 a.m. Eastern time on ashleyshelley.com. Again, I will write all of this information down below. And then there are the petite Ashley Shelley planners, which is the one I'm going to go into right now. And then there's the signature Ashley Shelley planners, which I will go into in a moment. So we're gonna get into the bad, the big boy in just a few minutes, but let's get into the petite one first because I think this is new. I, I've i looked at the other one before, like a while ago, but I've never seen this one in person. Maybe it's not new, I don't know. Oh, the shipping box got stuff on my desk. That's okay. That's what cleaners are for, y'all. Anyway, ooh, this feels like, mmm, feels like buttery soft. Ooh, I like this. Okay, let's zoom in a little bit so we can see it a little bit better. I believe that this comes in a couple of different colors if I remember right. Um, but anyway, it has this really beautiful silver foil. Again, just like that card, create your best days. And then it's got the 2021 and it's so like buttery soft. I don't, oh, it's really nice. I like that, okay. Anywho, so let me give you the specs on this. So this is the 2021 Petite Ashley Shelley Planner. This retails for $29.95. It is a lay flat book bound smooth leatherette wrapped cover. The inside pages are a five by eight and there's also a ribbon bookmark, which is right here in this kind of beautiful teal color. So I'm gonna put that up here for the moment and yeah we'll we'll get into it so perfect oh and also um they do have worldwide shipping as well because i did ask the question because i know that gets asked quite a bit so in the very front it's just like a dot pattern with the ashley shelley logo there is a little pouch right here which is really nice for um receipts or sticker sheets or anything you want to put in there um but yeah, I really like this. This is really nice. Uh, anyway, and then it says this planner belongs to, and then you can do whatever you want to with that. And there's a note from Ashley, some inspiration. 
Oh, and then they've got like contact information. So you can put like, if you've got kids, you can put like doctors or school information or work stuff or whatever. Um, and then favorite meal ideas. That's nice. And actually just looking at this, like if you had kids, this would actually be a really nice thing to have just like on your kitchen counter. If you have people coming in and caring for your kids or, you know, grandma or grandpa or auntie or uncle coming in and doing stuff. Um, this would be like a nice little thing for them. Anyways, sorry, uh, I digress. <laughs> Anyways, okay, so 2021 planning overview. So you've got all the months so you can put in like different goals or different to do's or just whatever the heck you want. That's really nice. I love these boxes. I use mine in the planner that I'm currently in. I use mine for like home improvement projects and I don't separate it by month. I separate it by like home area so like i have one that's like garage and then another one that's like master bathroom you know so that's kind of how i do it but i just take a little I, I if i was using this one i would just take a little sticker and um you know just put the sticker over because i love me some stickers and then we've got a yearly overview for 2021 and then 2022 which is great so you can kind of see where your dates land, especially if you're trying to like plan out some things. And then also 2021 holidays, that's always really nice to know as well. And then we have the monthly view of January. Also, I love this. I think I've said this in a couple other planner review videos, but I really like when they do um, the upcoming month. And it's always a bonus when they do the previous month too, like just a little view of that. Um, just so like for planning purposes so you don't have to keep flipping back and forth. I think that's really, really nice. And the paper is really, really smooth. It feels nice. It feels really nice, you guys. And then, okay, so this is kind of more of a guided page. So it says, create your best days in January. What are you grateful for right now? What are you worried slash stressed about right now? What can you do to remove your stress? And then it says, what creates happiness in your life that you want to do more of this month? What are you gonna say no to this month? Imagine your month ahead, write a few words that describe how you want to feel this month. And then here's like a checklist with self-care activities slash items monthly goals and then you can check them off i like the little yay right there and then your word of the month slash mantra very cool and then oh there's some notes so there's like two call oops sorry there's two columns here and then this is all just a one full note page so that's nice and then over here okay so you have like a little place to put your monthly word and then you've got like two columns of notes and then you've got some times over here that you can fill in um and then just it's kind of more of a horizontal planner but vertically a little bit so you've got like these times and you've got these lined little areas and then you've got this to-do checklist as well which is kind of interesting so you've got like monday december 28 and then like you got monday tuesday wednesday thursday friday saturday and sunday and they're all the same size which i actually really appreciate that they're all the same size because i really don't like when planner companies take saturday and sunday and they like merge them together where not everybody has the same type of schedule i'd rather have the same space for every day makes it easier for me even though i work a normal like monday through friday kind of a job but not everybody does you know um and i kind of like that these are untimed because you could do that for anything or you could just not even use these for times and use them for something else as well so anyway and then it also has like the little holidays on the right hand side of the teal uh header right there kind of cool so here's kind of how your weekly looks in this planner. Okay, so obviously they're all the same. So, all right, let's look at the very end of the month. All right, and then we're into February. Cool. All right, I'm not, as always, I'm not going to go through every page because then this video would be like super long. <laughs> let's get all the way to the back. 
um, and see. Sometimes there's extra sheets in the back, sometimes there's not, and that's okay. So, let's see here. All right. Okay, and there is no extra sheets in the back, which is totally fine. Um, but yeah, that is what this one is. And the, again, this is the 2021 Petite Ashley Shelley Planner. And this one retails for $29.95. But there is that $5 coupon code for you as well. And this is what the spine looks like. Very nice. Would look really, really pretty on a bookshelf. And then on the back, it has the logo in this really pretty silver foil as well. Yeah, and then you can just use this for your months or wherever you are in your book. Very cute, very, very cute. Okay, so let's move that off to the side. Next up, we got this bad boy, and this is the 2021 Signature Ashley Shelley Planner. This retails for $44.95. This is the wire O bound hardcover. It is has a slight gloss coating, and the inside page sizes are six by nine. It has perforated page corners to remove and create bookmark, which is kind of cool. This is the one that I have had a version of before so let's get into it all right and i think yeah i'm gonna have to zoom out a little bit because i want to show you guys the whole thing hold on whoa whoa okay cool perfect and like i'm not that big of a floral person but these navy flowers are kind of giving me life you guys there are a few different um colors and patterns to choose from of these planners just like fyi so just just putting it out there this is not the only one so make sure to check out the website love the reinforced corners those are amazing and um, i like that that matches the o-bound coil that's always really really nice and you guys know me i like everything but i don't like rose gold so yeah <laughs> anyway um but yeah it's a really nice hard cover very very nice and it just says 2021 on there with these kind of dark to lighter navy flowers very nice okay so let's get into this let's get you guys centered up and every time i try to center these i swear i don't center them because like when i go to edit these i'm like oh my gosh emily it's not centered at all <laughs> but whatever so anyway, just like the last book, it has the Ashley Shelley pattern right here. And this one has obviously a bigger little pocket in the front, which is nice to put stickers, receipts, whatever you need. And this one in the bound wire mechanism here has a really, really nice pouch, which already has some stickers in it. But let's look and see if there's anything else in there because you know i love me some stickers hold on come here here we go oh it's just stickers which is just fine so we've got a few different stickers very cool very cool i like it but yeah you could put lots of other things in here itineraries all this other good stuff and i like that it doesn't have a like zip or anything it just lays flat so it doesn't really add um too much of bulk to the planner and if you didn't want this in here you could like clearly just clip it out and then like clip it back in and out if you wanted to but it is stuck in here so anyway so oh see it's not <laughs> it wasn't centered <laughs> anyways so um yeah this is the front page and it just says this planner belongs to and the same information as the last planner and yeah this is all gonna look very similar to the last planner obviously but clearly this is a lot bigger and um here i'll do like a little size comparison for you guys actually hold on i'll do a size comparison this way so you guys can kind of see the difference yeah so it is different this for me would be a whole lot easier to like throw in my bag um, every day if you are a planner person that needs to take that with you every single day if you're a person like me where i don't take my planner with me anywhere 
typically. Um, I take my medical planner with me to doctor's appointments, but to be honest, most of, most of my doctor's appointments recently have been virtual, so I haven't had to do that, which has been kind of nice. But my medical planner is actually very similar sized to this, so it's really easy for me to throw it in my bag and I don't have to worry um, about bending the pages or anything like that because for me I feel like it's like really nicely protected. Um, I don't know. I just I just really like that kind of style for someone that just needs to have their schedule with them all the time. But my more decorative planner just sits on my desk. That's just my style. So anyway, but um, yeah, so there's this which is the same as the last one. Also, this is exactly the same as well. Obviously, it's a little bit bigger, clearly, just because we're in bigger pages. And I kind of, I'm living for these pages, by the way. <laughs> and then we've got our 2020 planning overview, which by the way, I love this page just because it's so versatile and you can do so many different things with it. Oh, and then by the way, um, I know it might be a little bit difficult to see. Maybe you can see it. Um, the, the little perforated edges right here, you can, um, these are the ones I was talking about with the perforated uh, page corners. You can remove these and they act like a bookmark. So you can start removing them because they go all the way through. And then you can use that as where you are in your book if you want to. So um, yeah, that's kind of a kind of a cool thing. All right, see, I'm screwing it up again. Here we go. All right, so if you have your yearly overview again of 2021 and 2022, your 2021 holidays. Um, let's see here. Da, 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 da. And then, yeah, these are the same as the last ones. And are these pages? I feel like this paper is a little thicker. Hold on, let me. Let me, let me feel it. Hold on guys, let me feel it. Hmm. Okay. The paper is definitely different. This to me, like this paper is a little bit more gritty. I don't mind a gritty paper at all. It's still smooth, but it's just got a little bit more grip to it where this is very silky um almost feels a little th thicker like a little hardier in a way does that make sense but i mean i like both papers i don't think either one's a bad one i'm just saying like it feels different but i mean clearly it's a different you know set up so that would make sense you know what i'm saying anyway so yeah and then the um weekly is exactly the same as the last planner i just showed just like that so yeah and then you can transfer over your monthly word as well as those goals that we had talked about before um which is really nice i kind of like this kind of muted colorway which also matches a lot of their covers which is kind of nice so again I'm not going to go through every single <laughs> month because they're all exactly the same but let's go to the end of the month um because you know I never I never know oh there is actually extra sheets in the back hold on here hold on I'm getting excited guys I'm getting excited okay so here's the end of the year or the beginning of the next year, 2022. So there are a few lined pages in the back. Still has the perforation on the corners if you guys can see. So you could use these for anything. And then we've got our hard cover on the back as well. Very cute. Very, very cute. All right, so that is gonna do it for my open box slash review of the upcoming release of the 2021 Ashley Shelley planners, the signature and the petite. 
Again, the launch day is going to be Friday, September 14th at 10 a.m. Eastern time on ashleyshelley.com. There is a coupon code for you guys. I will put all the information down below for $5 off. The coupon code is EMILY2021, and that will expire on September 30th of 2020. The signature is retailing for $44.95, and the petite is retailing for $29.95. If you are planning on grabbing one of these or have grabbed one of these, let me know down in the comments below. And also, if you've used one of these in the past, let me know in the comments down below as well. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it, and I will see y'all in the next video. Bye, guys. Well, folks, it's time to kick it old school. Uh, so you can feel cool. <laughs> Give it